Welcome back in our English classroom. Today, we will continue our work about describing a picture. And then, you will discover some elements about a very famous city. First, let's train for the picture description. Look at this picture and try to remember all the words you already know. Glasses, a newspaper, Red hair, to read, a boy, a guinea pig. Now, let's discover the new vocabulary to describe the picture. It's breakfast time for Danny Donut. Cornflakes, have breakfast. A bottle of orange juice, a glass, a bowl. Surprised. A chair, pyjamas, a plate, a table. Let's finish with the homework to send. You will choose a character, just one character. And then you will write three sentences using words you already know plus the vocabulary of this lesson. Of course, no Google translation. Good luck! And now it's time for you to describe the new picture. I ask you to write five sentences at least using words you already know plus the vocabulary of this lesson. Of course, you don't use any Google translation, but you can use present progressive, to look plus adjective, and the other structure you've already learned in the previous lesson. Good luck! Now, I would like you to guess where the story takes place. In which city does it take place in Barcelona, in Paris or in London? To answer this question, look at the bus Peanut is driving. It's a red double-decker bus and this bus is typical of London city. Let's discover the most famous places in London. Here is the Westminster Abbey, where queens, princes and princesses get married. Here is Piccadilly Circus. It looks like Times Square in New York. It's always crowded and there are lots of huge screens everywhere. Here is Trafalgar Square and the National Gallery. And here may be the most famous monument in London, Big Ben, the huge clock. Here is the Houses of Parliament and the famous big wheel in London called London Eye. Then Tower Bridge and London Tower. Now the Tate Gallery, modern art museum you will discover in Mystery at the Museum. And here St. Paul's Cathedral. Finish one of the most famous places in London, Buckingham Palace, where the Queen lives. Now let's play. For each sentence, try to guess which monument I'm describing. I may be the most famous clock all around the world. Who am I? In this place, William and Kate got married in 2011. I'm a very interesting museum dedicated to modern art. I'm a beautiful cathedral. I'm always crowded and noisy and I look like Times Square. I'm a huge big wheel. I look like a castle. In the past I was a jail, but now I'm only a museum. If you want to meet the Queen, it is the place to be. It's a very nice place with a big fountain and the National Gallery. I'm the place where the Parliament meets. I'm a bridge with two big towers for the Thames.